Hey guys, Sam Ricks and guys, sorry for not uploading for the past couple days right now. I actually got a little bit sick. I wasn't able to talk too much. Right now, my voice does sound pretty bad. So sorry if it does sound a little bit weird. So hopefully, I don't take too long of this right here. Uh, but let's get started here with the two new SH figures right here. And it's amazing looking figures. I can't believe these were actually announced. I like that. They look incredible. So the first one right here is going to be from the Naruto Wave. And it's going to be Uchimaru. And it looks amazing. The detail, the accessories out the back. You can see right here for his hand. You can see some snakes right there. They look awesome right here. How he looks, the expressions look incredible. Really, really cool. Looks incredible again. I'm super excited for this one. Um, we actually have the price point and when you can put her and of course when it's gonna be arriving. So right here, it's gonna be retailing right here for seven thousand seven hundred yen. Around the US, that's around fifty-four dollars and seventy-four cents. So most likely around sixty to seventy, most likely my guess for pricing for this one. And this right here is gonna be available pre-order June first or most likely June second. Usually it's always like a day after for like here in the for of course Japan for US so most likely it's gonna be that and it's gonna be releasing uh, October of this year so that's pretty exciting for that one amazing looking figure again I can't wait for this one and the best part is pretty cool actually is that you get a secondary portrait right here uh, for Sasuke right here so that's really really cool really glad it comes with that because lately it's been doing that for like with the one piece ones and some other of course um, figurines for other lines so that's really really cool so this one right here is definitely gonna be a buy it's so cool looking amazing looking posing of course pictures right here the tongue part right here is awesome so i'm really happy with this figure really really good you can see right there with the sword and like that awesome so for the second figure right here is gonna be from dragon ball and oh my gosh i was not expecting uh right here a super saiyan legendary uh goku right here like the full power version that he looks super super buff when he's fighting freezer right here and this looks awesome there's something i would definitely am disappointed by and that's gonna be like the battle damage um you can see some scuffings but compared to like the one they released a couple days ago or a couple weeks ago technically for the event of uh, like the super saiyan one first awakening he of course has some scuffings and some damage um you can see the detail but for this one right here it doesn't have it so it's kind of disappointing with this one right here i'm very annoyed by that especially um because we got that for the event exclusive but how come for not for this one uh so that's the only complaint i would definitely say uh right here for price points actually pretty decent right here it's giving me 7150 yen and for the us right here it's giving me 50 dollars and 83 cents um so most likely uh 50 to 60 to 65 maybe um this right here is gonna be releasing june uh first for pre-order so for pre-order for that and releasing november of this year so that's pretty cool right there so here are the pictures for it it looks insane actually i love how it looks he looks really buff you see the battle damage on the clothing looks awesome i love of course when they do this kind of version of goku right here with the battle damage um so so cool right there the expressions right here look awesome very very good i think it's probably one of the best expressions we got here for goku uh for these figures right here for a very long time um right here of course you get an effect piece right here that's pretty cool uh but here's the expression right here that really shocked me that looks incredible really really cool love how that looks right there and the pose right there is again really really good too um right here some other posing right here with, of course different expressions that looks awesome here's of course like the regular one right there of course like, like a grinning one that looks really really cool and right here's of course he has like a different hair piece right here of course going uh full of course power right there and that looks so cool so for this one right here i'm super excited for i was not expecting this um when of course we got a new like thing i think it was a tease for of course a new figure i was expecting maybe like gogeta from gt or i was expecting maybe like a, a full of course uh power of frieza most likely so from seeing this we're most likely going to get that in a little bit in the future uh hopefully that looks amazing so so far really really happy with this one can't wait for more updates if there's any more figures from of course this line from sh figures like that i'll definitely let you guys know for sure so far really really good from this line sorry of course again if i sound weird uh, my voice is not that good right now but that's everything there guys tell me down your opinion about this if you guys gonna pick up any of these just tell me down below hope you guys enjoyed see you next time bye